Welcome back team. You're gaming with the Colonel and this is the Total Realism Project for Strategic Command WW2 World at War. We're playing Kubelwagen and boy is this game different with this with this mod with this mod. It is different. So there are so far what I've noticed the map is much bigger. Aerial spotting is much bigger. There's no double chitting on research and there's twice as many turns. Well, let's see what uh, Kubelwagen did to us today. We're just, this is turn two. We just invaded Poland, and we'll see what we can get done. Since there are so many turns, I am uh, trying to get my research in there early. We'll see what happens. get two okay so the question is do we want to go up that road I have no idea what I'm doing over there that's for sure So you should be a couple of guys out of supply there. I'm hoping to finish off Poland this turn, but it may not happen. Took some money from him there. Send you boats. Yeah, I'm working on it. Okay, let's get up here. You might as well go ahead and move up here. You know, I have a 12. You already have a 12. You do have a 12. You're a 10. You're a 10. You're an 11. 12. Now 12. So you can come on out. Go over here. So the other, only other 12 I have is over here. I've got one more. Okay, good to go. Why doesn't it show me the strength of that port? Okay, there we go. All right, <clears throat> that's it for the Italians. I don't know what to do about these bubbas down in here. <clears throat> Bunch of infantry divisions and no, <clears throat> no headquarters. Let's check this out. So you're almost dead. I don't think I'm going to have enough units to get in here.
this guy has three entrenchment. He will have to die for me to get in there. slide through all the way if I kill this guy. No, he cannot. <clears throat> Can I get to seven? Two, three, four. <clears throat> Let's take that. Do this. The loaf off is key. That's four. That's all I got for action points. Infantry is better in here. the headquarters. This guy has two strikes. This guy only has one. to come over here and hurt that guy. This is, uh, I gotta contain him. Yeah, didn't get a chance to kill him. That's unfortunate. But we now know where the bomber is. Kill as many of these as possible. You still have two strikes. for sure.
We gotta hold that guy from doing anything stupid. hold him in place. Can't get there. Gosh, I'm doing less less than I should be every time. And you're gonna get stuck in here now. Do I end up using more? Eight, so it's the exact same now. The exact same as being there. Should check that first. Okay, we'll leave them there if it's the exact same. We're gonna cruise on over. We'll move a little bit closer here. In case I need you one last time. I don't know that I will, but we'll check. This is kind of dangerous for me, so we need to come off of here. We need to come off of there. Move this way. I still think he's given 10. Once I move here, it's 8. He could come in here. See how he's got like 3 or 4 action points. 3. So 1, 2, 3, and hit me would be bad. I think I'll back up one more to here. He can come down, hurt this guy, who is currently just a tritting away. Do I want the experience? I don't really want to lose stuff, but... Oh, I got another strike here. I didn't know that. I haven't used that yet. three still not worth it to lose that although we're gonna have to refit anyway
Let's see here. Let's just put you back in here. No reason not to cover you. I think we can start moving this guy the other direction. Now let's just hem you in. Probably got a guy in here. We'll take this guy in the other direction. Okay. The only thing that would be good is if I had this guy over here somewhere. He's not really doing a lot for the headquarters that he is. Even if I move him forward one. But if I move him to here. That might help. Yeah, now I can take a couple extra guys. All right. I think we're good there. The only other question is, do we attack this guy? He's got a... Why does he have a... Oh, he's got supply of zero. Yeah, he's going to have one action point. He's going to go nowhere. Um, I think we could kill him. Look at the difference that makes with that one guy. That's huge. Okay, I think we're done over here. Let's check on my uh, submarines. Some supply. Get you down here. And that's it for the Germans. Money wise, going to do some research. One of these three. Production would also be good. I think we definitely need them for two weapons here. And advanced tanks as well. Giving me a 45. Could start saving that. What does it cost to upgrade? 
15. That's much cheaper. Okay, uh, can I upgrade if it's against? No, they've got to be pulled off. So let's fix you or upgrade you, reinforce you. One point. Oh, might as well do two. Okay, no money left. Italians, research. Am I going to need anti-tank? Oh yeah, that's different. Okay, long range, yes. Ground attack, yes. <sighs> Heavy bombers would be something to consider. Infantry weapons I don't have enough money for. Infantry warfare I do. Let's do it. And we won't spend anything else. Not that we can't. We only have seven left. Although it's seven, can we? No, nope, we cannot. All right. This guy's sitting here on a port. He's going to be useful somewhere eventually. All right, let's head on over to Japan, which I have no idea how to play. So this is a special forces. That's a special forces, so they can... Do long-range amphib transport. They can do 13 of those. Wow. So I don't need to research any of that. All right, where's my other? It's a fighter. It's a fighter. That's a tactical bomber. All right, let's, uh, let's bring you down. Rain here is bad. Three action points, but can't do anything in the rain. That costs two action points right there. If I can upgrade you next time, I will. I might upgrade you guys here. One of them next turn. <coughs> it's now a 1-1. One, one. some research going here before I figure out something else. Infantry weapons, artillery weapons. Command and control, although I have plenty of guys. So I think it's going to be 
anti-sub, advanced subs, artillery, naval, infantry. Let's throw that shit in infantry. Let's upgrade this guy. For 16. Let's reinforce him. What is the upgrade on this guy? Naval. Now I want to attack whole hog on that. He's not doing anybody. Literally no one. So he can be moved. Probably get to the coast and it's cost to operate these guys. 20. 20 early on, that's a lot early on. get those guys covered. He just has that one fighter. Let's get you to the coast. Let's get you to the coast. Over here, do we want to stop, start backing stuff up or what do I want to do here? You now have a 12. Who does not? 12, 12, 12, 12, 11, 11, 12. You can go over to a 10 port and fix. Don't have any 10 ports over there. Okay, these two are 12s. here to fix at a 12 in the 10th port. Oh, that's a 5 port. Damn it. These are all 5s. You're 12 already. Okay, come on down here. Oh, that's why I put you up there to begin with. Because you need an upgrade.
get you guys back to the coastline. Wouldn't want rough seas to hit you for no reason. guys around it's just gonna be painful all right what else we got here I need to upgrade these guys and then get them into the fight gonna move these guys closer that guy's got to stay that guy's got to stay that guy's got to stay he's got to stay he's got to stay he's got to stay Crap, I got one here. All right, I might have to spend 20 and get another dude down there. Well, we got a whole infantry corps up there. He costs 20 to move. Everything costs 20 to move, huh? Yep. I want to bring him down here. I got 40. I can bring two. Is literally not doing anything. Let's get him to a point. Can I fit, get him upgraded and prepare to use him? I think it, let's do that. Well, let's rail him first. This is going to take away some of his stuff. We're going to need him down here. Bring him in there. And that leaves us with no money. So I think we are now done with that. This is huge over here. 12 ports. In fact, it's so huge, we may want to get some guys over there now. Probably the, well, let's see here. Hawaii really doesn't play into this, does it? There's Johnson Atoll. Wake does. There's Hawaii. Three ports. There's Midway. And there's Guam. I have no idea how that's going to play out. China is way bigger and harder to deal with. I don't know how I'm going to get through here. We're done. All right, let's hit the button. Kübelwagen, du bist dran. And uh, give me a boost of some kind. Germany honors the Soviet Nazi partition pact. Non-aggression pact, yeah. Poland surrenders. Outstanding. So we did it in two turns, even though they're much bigger and had a lot more units. Good deal. So now we can start moving towards the other direction. We're going to have a lot of research going on next turn. And I 
but some research. Help Spain rebuild from the Civil War. Mein Führer, our allies in Spain continue to struggle after their victory in the Spanish Civil War. As Spain continues to rebuild, our advisors suggest any assistance we can offer will move Generalissimo Franco closer to our side of the war. The deliveries in Spain will mainly be food supplies directed to the nation's starving population through Italian shipping. Cost will be continuous at five per turn. However, we can expect the supplies to be delivered for less than one year. That's 52 times five. Okay, let's take a look at the notes here. 52 times five, that's a, a good chunk. Uh, 260 MPP. Uh, the total cost of shipping are indefinite in nature. German supplies will stop flowing after Italy has joined the war. You select yes. You can expect three to three to six percent closer, and Italy will be prompted to consider suit. Doing another three to six. Okay, we're going to do it. I, I don't see why not. Franco welcomes access assistance. Okay, another one. Von Rippentrop to Switzerland, Mein Führer. We should expect Switzerland to maintain their long-standing position of neutrality throughout the course of the war. With a little risk, with little risk or benefit of the Swiss government entering the war on either side, it is advisable that we use Swiss banking system to store our plundered gold reserves and convert currencies so that we can conduct trade with neutral European countries which otherwise may not be possible. We should also establish trade between our two nations. By sending diplomats to Switzerland, we can almost ensure the Swiss will be cooperative. And while Switzerland will officially remain neutral, we should be careful to maintain a positive relationship with the country or risk devastating our foreign trade. Wow. Manfiola, do you approve sending this for 15 MPP for two turns? So 30 MPP. These are all new events. I love it. If you select yes, Switzerland moves 20, 15 to 20% closer. Okay, that works. Um, for 30 MPP, that's cheap. Act as an agent of foreign trade. So maintaining it, which means we can't let them go in the wrong direction. So we're going to send it, yes. What else is going to happen here? Give me occupies Western Poland, yeah. It's going to be Eastern Poland. Well, they took a large chunk of that, didn't they? Turkish government is upset. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, minus 5, minus 15, plus 5 from Yugoslavia. Two hundred fifty-five. That's not a lot of money. It's 77 for Italian. That's nothing. We're going to have to work on Italy. All right. You've been gaming with the Colonel. Please like, subscribe, come back early, come back often. I am out.